Welcome. So today I thought I'd do a really quick video on how to activate Moog's Great Rune. So in order to activate Great Runes, we've been going to these different Divine Towers uh, throughout the lands in Elden Ring. Well, this one we've already been to, because I believe he and Morgoth are brothers, so that's why you take their Great Runes to the same spot. So where are we at? Well, we're here at the Divine Tower of East Altus. You know, basically, you know, if you go to where you're trying to get to the Forbidden Lands, but instead you hang it right, come down here, you know, you gotta fight a couple of omens to get over here, and then, yeah, you just ride the uh, elevator on up to here. So all you do, you just run over here, restore the power of the Great Rune, And now Moog's Great Rune is active. And what does it do? I think it's like a... I'm not really sure. I've never used it. It's got some funky thing going on with it. What, what do you do? Grants a blessing of blood to phantoms. Yeah, I'm not really sure what that does, but, you know, I, I don't want it. So I think it's like a PvP-oriented one. Like, your summons get it. Like, if it caused blood loss, you know, they get, like, a buff. So, anyway. Um, but, yeah, so, I mean, if you're looking to do, like, some PvP type stuff, I guess it'd be helpful. But, anyway, that's how you activate Moog's Great Rune. Hope you enjoyed it. Found it useful. Talk to you soon. Hope you're having a great day. Bye for now.